Ladies and gentlemen, again, this video is coming live from Jamaica in the San Canuga 2015 camp, youth camp in central Jamaica. Uh, we are coming to the last final days of the camp and I have with me on my couch Vashon McLeod. How are you doing, sir? Well, it's a pleasure to be here. Yeah. Actually, um, currently, I am a preacher who I fallen off track and I wish to restart my life. However, I made some bad decisions, but thanks to Pastor here, I've learned to stop and think before I proceed. Mm -hmm. Now, there are some decisions that I made in the past which have resulted in me not being a preacher anymore. I've been bad at mm -hmm. the devil's camp. But ever since recently, the message the Lord impressed my heart and I recommitted my life, resulting in a rebaptism. Oh. In camp, in camp, in camp, because of the Stop and Think program, which is right. However, I would like the pastor to remember me when he goes back over. Right. I would like for him to also, I don't know, maybe allow me to come over his country maybe sometime soon, as there are more opportunities. Okay. There. All right. So we'll talk about that. Of course, you and I will talk about that. But well, I have a question for you. Now, because young men will be looking at this video, tell me, and they may need the help that you got. When you say you fell from grace, you left the church, what kind of stuff did you get into, if you don't mind telling us, so we could tell some boys okay. that into? Okay, I used to smoke ganja. Smoke weed? Right. Right. Bad company, jam. Gangs. Guns. You want to turn this way, right? Guns. You're right, guns. Yes. However, during all of this, I never... I still had that little fire inside of me. You still had a little voice yes, inside of you? Yes, that little flame for Jesus was here. So, my tears, when they see me smoke, they get upset. Mm. When they see me do bad things, they get upset because they're looking forward to me to come and elevate them. So now that you gave your heart to Jesus again, and you learned to stop and think, right? tell me what you think about it, the presenter. Was he presented in such a simple manner that you understood everything that was said? Everything clearly, clearly. And do you think he was talking to you personally? Yes. He was speaking in general, but I believe that it was the Holy Spirit who impressed my heart. Through this man, he was the messenger. Yes, sir. All right. Now, a question to you, Vishan. Do you think this concept of stop and think could do Jamaica well? Very. If half of Jamaica, had this concept of stop and think before you proceed, we would have the best economy worldwide. Wow, wow. Well, my brother, thank you very much for your time. I appreciate thank it. You. The world will be hearing this message. Thank you.